matches to come. It's just one of those unusual things that has happened in the with the way the fixture has worked out for Amazulu. In fact, uh, after this seven of their next nine matches will be away from home. So they absolutely need to pick up points here. Could be a chance here to fire one in. Oh, what a finish! All the time in the world, unmarked, controlled, picked a spot. And I tell you what, Montembanja will never score an easier goal. Oh, all the time in the world to pick a spot. He's off the mark, Montembanja. Only his second start of the season, and he is up and running with his first goal of the season but wow Nyame will not be happy with the defending in front of him there Brian Martin what did I do now that's what Manga is asking mm. what did I do collectively you did not defend well Jose you look at how disjointed they look it looks like they're organized they're still giving away possession you look at the numbers they have in the box but who is unmarked wow I mean look at the numbers there's about six players up against two players in the box and you get punished for that and look at Banja he had time to yes. control the ball and still pull the trigger and that's question marks in yeah. terms of the defending receives the ball completely unmarked and uh, duly punishes them at his it's very crucial for the team but the energy levels here they go again and now Exton is in here surely surely now oh my word oh my goodness what this it, is wasteful Banja Monty Banja second corner only the second corner of the game as we hit the 20th minute mark it's a game that Amazulu have dominated thus far and should well really they should be out of sight already even 20 minutes into the game one could say so let's see what Hanamu can deliver here from a set piece in swing on the left that left boot of his confidence really how many more chances are they gonna miss so when he miscontrols the ball, there's no one there to pounce again and take advantage of a, the poor first touch. Somebody gets a second bite at the cherry. It's all looking too easy at the moment for Usu too. It's 2-0, two Brandmata. Too easy. But I'll tell you where it starts. It's not just the defense because defense is not just the, the back four. But it all starts in the midfield where they have been dominated. And we've been saying there are times where you've got to start suffering, you've got to press, you've got to chase. And at this stage, we look at jersey number 10. Pedestrian in approach, the act numbers, they're making inroads into that defense. You look at the numbers as well. It will be question marks because Quem has got about three players that he just sneaks in. There's three players. He just went past really. the final one. And then he just gets there, still has a second chance to convert. It doesn't start there. Here, yeah, already damage is done, but it all started in the midfield as well. So there is no, and I say it, it's minus one in the midfield. Yeah. Augustin Chidiquem takes his tally to five. Well, why and Dale has got the guts. Yeah, well, well, of course, he's the coach. He's, coach. he's, <laughs> he's been one of those arrogant players based on how he played football. You know, he was always imposing himself. Cutting a lonely figure out there. Much energy. Oh, Wade Yost, the beautiful stuff there. Now, can Quem get there? He does get there at first, but he manages to get the ball. Extin, they're lining up again here. Mazulu. Hanamoub! It's a tap in for Chidi Quem. He's on a brace now. He's got a brace now. He's on a hat trick. Wow. This is getting this could be embarrassing at this rate this could be a big score line 30 minutes gone three nil i mentioned 
Don't leave me hanging, says Billy yeah. Botswa. Don't Ozan leave me hanging. Gimba, please. Mila Mbaneli na paande. Come give Ozani, Handaka, come to me as well. Because the energy is there. That's what the coach spoke about. The structure is there. Respect our structure. Fluent football. That's what he spoke about. And this is what we are seeing on display. It took a little bit of a deflection. But hey, they were in the box. They were fishing. Sure. And they got it right. It's a, it looks like an easy tap. You know, but it was well worked. I tell you. Royal AM look like they'd rather be somewhere else because they're certainly not here. No. Their bodies may be here, but they simply... What is going on out there? It is a most... It is a, such a poor display thus far in the first half. Take nothing away from Amazulu. As you said, they played... Amazulu's uh, three goals came in 32 minutes. So... Uh, Couple of quick goals here, or even just one goal here, could make things very interesting. Because at the moment, Damazulu are playing within themselves, so I guess uh, managing the game, as we say. But there could be problems here! And Msimela finally has a save to make. Where have you been? Mm. Royal oh, AM. This combination play, these clinical touches that you're having, the shots on target. On point. Spiewek. It's a tricky one for defenders. Spiewek Kaila, it was. They, they got the shot on target. The first on target for Royal AM. Took it well. Awkward for keeper. Here's Menzi Masugu with, the, with only the second corner of the game. Tarek Phillies. Those numbers, Brian, in terms of when the goals do come. Royal AM look. Charles shot and Zimela. His gloves being stung for only the second time. A bit more respectability about this, the performance in the second half, no doubt. Definitely. And I think it all starts with matches. They've uh, drawn three and uh, won three and drawn just the, the, the one match. Now this is a major setback for them. Just when it looked like they were turning things around, Brian Martin. Zimela was uh, taken out in mid-air there. Sera has already been booked. Gianni with a cross in. That is actually quite good, really. It's very brave, that is, then to go pound for pound with a keeper. Yeah, I'm not sure he was, he was ever in the contest for that one there, Sera. It was always a uh, ball close. It was too close to the keeper. 